This is an ISE special. My name is Tim Albright. I am your host. We are previewing Integrated Systems Europe 2018. Uh, if you're not familiar with ISE, it is the world's biggest AV show, uh, AV trade show. Comes your way February 6th through the 9th in Amsterdam uh, at the Rye. Uh, what we're doing is we are interviewing folks who are going to be exhibiting at ISC, kind of trying to find out kind of what they're doing, uh, what they'll be exhibiting so you can make your plans accordingly. Uh, with me today is Kevin Hansen. Kevin is from Luxel. How are you, sir? Hey, Tim. I'm very well. Thanks you. Good. Uh, real quickly before, before I forget, because I will, uh, you guys are in Hall 1, Q as in Queen 120, Hall 1, Q, Q120. Uh, I've been telling folks I consider Hall One kind of the main hall, or at least one of the bigger halls. Uh, mm -hmm. Right as you walk in uh, to the right there, yep. it's got a lot of uh, a lot of blinking lights, a lot of uh, nice displays, yep. um, and, and lots of cool things. Uh, you guys, uh, of course, are a part of Legrand. You are not a part of Legrand's booth, but you're in the same right. you're in the same hall, right? So if it's you're at Legrand, yep. yeah, if you're at Legrand's booth, walk down the 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 aisle way, and you'll and you'll run into into Luxel's uh, Luxel's stand. Yeah, and of course, the tie-in with Legrand is they purchased us almost two years ago now. And, uh, but still, for this show, we're separate. Uh, some shows were together. This one would have to be a little separate. All right. Uh, so if we're, we're in Hall 1 and we come upon, come upon uh, Q120, uh, what are we going to find when we come into uh, Luxel's stand? Yeah, we actually have several, several new things we're bringing. We're going to announce and show at the show. Um, one of the main things is we've been talking about domotes for some time. And now, finally, we're shipping domotes on the 3150 routers, so that's just started shipping. Um, and then it'll also be on our Epic 4 series of routers. So basically our router becomes kind of this platform where we're going to be, be adding other little applications like domotes and router limits. And those are both now shipping on, on, the, on the 3150 and on the Epic 4. All right, if somebody's not familiar with domotes, what, what exactly is it? It's kind of a, a, of a overarching uh, pitch on it. Great question. So domotes, it's kind of that next level of management, of proactive management of, hey, let's, let's avoid the truck roll whenever we can. So the first thing it does, um, if you're familiar with Fing, it goes out there, they own Fing, and they, they take that technology, they go out, they find everything on your network, they discover it, they categorize it so you know what's there. So first it's information. The second thing you get with that is you get the ability to then um, you have, a, have an early warning system. So when something goes offline, something goes down, you get a little push notification through your app or an email on your, on your, your email box that says, hey, there's a problem with this product. Okay, so that's, that's great, but now what do I do with it? And that's the third line is, okay, now I can do something about that. So I can either remote into that site uh, through, a, through a, like an on-demand VPN, or I can, uh, I can reboot it, power cycle it, either by using PoE, or if it's on a PDU, I can then, uh, power cycle that device, which you think about it, if you're rolling a truck, nine times out of 10, all you're gonna do is go on power cycle device, and you've just spent, you know, $150, $200, where now I can do all that remotely, no truck roll necessary. Uh, is this something where, we, we've talked with a lot of folks who are, have different solutions for monitoring uh, software, whether it's baked into mm -hmm. uh, a yeah. server or it's, it's a secondary piece. Is it something where you see your, your dealers using this as a, a form of recurring revenue? Or is it something where this is something that they should automatically um, uh, offer to their clients? That is a, a huge question. As you know, in the AV space, uh, recurring revenue is something we talk about an awful lot, but uh, we don't always execute on it. So we're, we're doing what we can to help dealers. We offer these two things, router limits and domotes. Both of those are potential for recurring revenue. If the dealer has the ability to execute on that, otherwise we're seeing a lot of dealers. They just bake it into the price of the job, and they then um, they just make it a service that they offer, and they either charge for it or they're saving money on it, uh, on not having to roll that truck, and they do it that way. Right. It's easy to both ways. Okay. All right. So what else are we are we going to be seeing in the in the Luxel stand? Yeah. The other things you'll see as far as new things. Of course, we have all of our all our existing things. Um, we've had uh, the new things you're going to see is we've replaced our lower end access point. The XAP 310 is now the XAP 810. That's really just getting it up to today's standard of, of everything being AC, so better speed, dual band, a little bit better processing power, and a little higher price on this one as well. And then the other thing we had not had before is we hadn't had the ability to do uh, point to point bridging in Europe. Um, that's something we've been doing in the States for quite some time. It's a little more complicated internationally. Uh, where some of, the, some of the regulations make it kind of cost prohibitive, but we've now uh, brought that to market. It's our bridge kit where 
I might use this if I'm, uh, I'm trying to connect to a pool house or a tennis club or just an outbuilding where maybe it's too far away to, 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 to get a cable there. Or maybe it's, I don't want to be disrupted by trenching over that area. And I can do all this with a, with a, a, a link at each end. Basically, if you think about it as running a wire, I'm running it over the air and I'm connecting one location with another location. It might be for security cameras. It might just be for connectivity. Once I get it there, then I decide what I'm going to do with it. But that's a new kit that's coming out here. We're announcing uh, here at the show. What is the distance limitation on that? This is the limitation. So we've, we've done our testing out. We've been out, you know, a mile, even two miles. But oh, wow. the real reality here is most people, they needed to go 200 yards, 300 yards. So the, the official stance is it's a half mile line of sight. But the beauty of it is, is because this is an AC product as well, um, we were getting 400, sometimes 500 megabits per second over this, uh, where it used to be the bridges, you know, you might get, you know, 40, 50, 60 megabits per second. Now we're getting almost 10 times that at 400, 500 megabits per second. Think about, I can put, you know, 10 cameras on one end of that, and I can stream all that content across back to the NVR, back to the Muddy Show. Good night. That's yeah, awesome. so cool stuff. All right. Uh, again, if you are going to ISE, uh, the, the stand number is Hall 1, Q as in Queen, 120. Uh, but Kevin, not everybody's going uh, to ISE. So if they're not going, but they still want to follow along with everything you'll be releasing, uh, February 6th through the 9th, uh, how can they do that? Uh, best way is probably on our website, luxel.com. Of course, well, we, we, we're very active in social media, on Twitter, on uh, Instagram. But probably Facebook is where the most stuff is. Look for Luxel Corp on all of those. You'll find us there. And, uh, hey, I'll, I'll, you're going to be in Amsterdam? I will indeed. I'll certainly be. I think this is the uh, sixth or seventh time I've been in a row. So it's always a great show. But if you can't make it, check us out on Facebook, Instagram, Luxel.com. All right, very good. Kevin Hansen from Luxel. Uh, for more information about us, you can find us at avnation.tv. avnation.tv, this program, and a host of others. We are already previewing uh, Integrated Systems Europe 2018, so you can watch other other uh, interviews like this. And we will be hitting the ground running uh, come February 6th uh, in Amsterdam. So uh, follow along as we bring you Integrated Systems Europe 2018 at avnation.tv. avnation.tv.